Caleb, do you want to start us off? Can you tell us what number two is? What kind of triangle are we looking at at number two? Ma'am, that is a, um, is it a, is that a scaly, ma'am? Think of this big angle. What kind of angle is this? Is it the obtuse? Yes, it's an obtuse angle. So what does this tell us about my triangle? What kind of triangle is it? It doesn't have equal sides. Good. So I know, I know first that it's obtuse. So if it doesn't have any equal sides or any equal angles, what kind of triangle do we call it? A scalene. Good. It's a scalene triangle. Amazing. Good. Because it has nothing in common. I hope you remember we learned about this. It has nothing yes. in common. All right. Well done, Caleb. Okay. I think it's going to take us quite a while to, to get back in the groove of things, but I'm, I'm glad it's coming back to you, isn't it, Caleb? Yes, ma'am. Excellent. All right. Well done. All right. Indy Nako, are you there? Can I ask you about number three? Oh, no. Indy Nako, where did you go? Okay. Ramwato, <laughs> can I ask you about number three? Number three, it's an obtuse on the left hand side, on my left hand oh, side. Good. And on the right hand side? It's an ice cold. You know, mm -hmm. It's a nice. It's an isosceles triangle. Good. I I'm glad you remember that you can also call it an isos because maths and math teachers are very lazy. So we call it an isosceles. Do you remember why we call it an isosceles, Ramato? It's because the, uh, the triangle bases are. Uh, uh, angles are in uh, are equal. Good. And the angle, the base the angles are equal. And the two sides. Are equal. Excellent. Yes. Excellent. Well done. Amazing stuff. Very well done. All right, Nell. Do you want to do number four for us? You're going to have to unmute for me, my sweetie. Hi, Nell. Oh, I'm sorry, I muted you. Can you unmute again, please? <laughs> sorry. Hello. Hello, Neil. Hi. Hello. Can you tell me what kind of triangle do we have in number four? Um, number four, we have uh um we have an acute angle. Good, triangle, it's an acute actually. angle triangle, good, because all our angles are acute. But what kind of triangle, well, how else can we classify it? Um, Is it equilateral, isosceles, or scalene? A scalene, I think. Oh, no, it's not a scalene. Mm, remember, what does this tell us? Luna's giving you an, a, a clue in the chat. What do these three things tell us? What does it tell us about the sides that they are? Equal. Good, they're equal. So if all the sides are equal, what do we call that kind of triangle? An equilateral um, triangle. Good, it's an equilateral triangle. Excellent. And remember that all the angles are also going to be equal. Do you remember what the angles are going to be equal to now? Do you remember? I don't remember. Ah, okay. I'm going to remind you, every single one of these angles is going to be 60 degrees. That's something that we need to remember. It's very important. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Hey, you're very welcome, SVD. I love you for trying. Keep trying. Keep putting your hand up and trying. Okay. Yes, okay. Excellent. All right. Okay, I'm, I'm glad it's coming back to some of you guys, the kind of triangles we learned on Monday. That's why I'm saying Monday's lesson is very, very important. We need to remember these. These triangles are going to come up again when we do quadrilaterals or four-sided shapes. So I need, need you guys to get these right. Okay, I need you guys to get these right. Now, today we're going to be learning something completely new. First thing we're going to do is we're going to need a calculator, number one. And then I'm going to need you guys to take whatever piece of paper. I think our grade 10s actually have a great system. They have a Watobi notebook. So if you could get yourself a Watobi notebook, I think that would really help. And what I need you guys to do is to split your page in two. Okay. I need you to split your page in two for me. And then what I need you to do is on the left side, 
on the left side. I mean, don't cut it in half, just fold it. Oh God, okay, this is the wrong word. Fold, <laughs> fold your page in two. Siolise, we are learning about triangles because I can tell that Siolise is, uh, is new. And if you're a bit stuck, Siolise, I need you to go watch Monday's episode, okay? Uh, Lelente, you can just buy any ordinary tech, uh, notebook and you can call it a Watobi notebook. But mm, thanks for that. I think maybe I should spark like, Teacher Kat, what do you think if we started looking at, um, at making Watobi notebooks so that everybody can have like a designated Watobi notebook? I think yeah, that's so all the notes are in one place. You know what I mean? Yeah, mm -hmm. and if you're with us in January, you can look at everything we've done since January. I think that's a cool Right? Idea. Yeah. I love it. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to tell the, the the big man upstairs that maybe um, we should get Watobi notebooks for the kids. All right. So I need you guys on the left side. Draw this. I need you guys to draw this with all the stuff that's on the inside. Now, I'm so glad it's your first time and you're so confident to answer questions. I love, love, love it. You're doing a great job. OK, and once you're done. Uh, drawing all of this, then um, can I ask you guys to please put a thumbs up in the chat? Um, Kamohelo, I see you. Um, do you have a question? Can I ask you to maybe type it in the chat and then I can address it? Excellent. Jaden's done already. Oh, Lisa, what did this at school on Monday? Excellent. Caleb is done. Luanje is done. No quesi, super sife, lebohile. And Bandile is done. And Rolivua. Lusheva, hello Lusheva, I haven't seen you in a while, or maybe I just haven't heard your voice or your DMs. And Rahel, hello guys, it's so great to see you all today. Titan, you didn't miss very much. All I need you guys to do is draw this, okay? Then underneath the drawing, I need you guys to put this. I need you guys to put statement and I, put, I need you guys to put reason, okay? And then draw a line, draw this line as well, okay? Siolisa, so, uh, so oh, look at what I did. Siolisa, so everyone is on mute so we can keep the quiet of the room. Okay. Um, if you guys are a little bit confused as to how we can fold the paper in half, you're just going to take a piece of paper, let's say it's in your book, and this is it. Okay. Let me just see. Just so. so if this is my piece of paper in my book, just fold it in half like this. Make sure that the one end touches the other like that. Okay like that, and then you just fold the inside track there, fold the inside track like that, and then open it up, and then you're holding it like this. So there's like a middle, there's like a middle fold here in the middle, okay? And then on the left-hand side, on the left-hand side, you're gonna draw the triangle, and then underneath the triangle, you're gonna write statement, and on the other side, you're gonna write reason, okay? And for those of you who say we did this at school on Monday or we did it last week, you guys are going to have to help us out because some, some people haven't done it yet. Okay, and you guys are going to help us out with, with this particular one. All right, I'm going to show everyone how this particular one is done um, just so that we're all on the same page as we go along. Okay, so can you guys remind me again in the chat, how much is the sum of all the angles inside a triangle? sum of angles in a triangle. How much do all the angles inside the triangle equal to? Nosipa says, sum of angles in a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. Very well done. Very well done. Guys, I think you guys are very familiar with this. Okay, so the reason why I say we're going to need our calculator is because we're going to need to use it to calculate for A. Okay, but the way that we write this, the way that we set it out, is very, very, very important, okay? I need you guys to follow along with what I'm writing in your book on that folded page so that you don't, you don't kind of miss it as we go, right? I know that A plus 65 plus 75 needs to equal to 180 degrees. But why do I know that? It's because it's the inside angles of the triangle. So when I write this out on my piece of paper, what I'm going to have to write is on my statement side, on my statement side, I need to write A 
plus 65 degrees plus 75 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. Okay, and my reason on this side is going to be it's the angles sum inside or just in, and I'm very lazy, so I write this in triangle and I draw a triangle like that. But you can write the word triangle. Okay, angles sum in triangle. Okay, for now, what I need you guys to do is write exactly what you see on your screen. Underneath statement, I need you to write there, A plus 65 degrees plus 75 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. Okay. And on the reason side, I need you guys to write angles, sum, and triangle. Okay. And for those of you who are jumping the gun a little bit, I need you guys to watch what I'm, I'm going to do next. Saneliso and Caleb and Kama, oh, not Kama. Somebody else already gave us the answer. But the reason why I want you guys to hold on with the answer is because the process that we need to go through is very, very important. Okay, now, yes, can you, you write this under your drawing? Okay, so what's gonna happen here is you're gonna draw this drawing in your book and underneath you're gonna have statement. Remember you folded your paper in half, statement on the one side and this is the fold. And then on this side, there is reason like this. Okay, and on the statement side, you're going to write this. You're gonna write all of this. And on the reason side, you're gonna write this, angle, sum, and triangle, okay? Can I get a heart emoji in the chat once you're done? Everybody, as soon as you're done with that, please put a heart emoji in the chat for me. I love Olika's heart emoji comes like with, with fire. It's like a fire heart. Okay. Kungao, I need your, your question to make to, to be a little bit more refined. When you say with what miss, I need you to be very specific on where I've lost you. Okay. Lina, I need you to put your hand up for me, please, my sweetie, so that we can address where I've lost you. Okay. Um, Kungao, can I ask you to please DM teacher cat? Okay. You can draw the drawing under the table now, it's fine. Okay, the reason why I want the drawing there is so that we know where we're getting all of these answers from. Because next time you open your book and you look, you're like, hi, but what does all of this mean? I don't even know what it means. As long as you have the drawing there, you'll be able to know what we're talking about. Okay, Titan, I hope that broken heart still means you understand and, and we're following each other. Okay, all right. So here's what comes next. Now, once we've done this, we've got statement, and reason, right? Now, what we're gonna to have to do is we're going to have to solve for A, but we're going to do that thing where we jump over the rainbow or transpose as some of you guys call it. Ooh, Anati, come on, dude, come on. I'll give you 10 more seconds, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one. Okay, I'm not to your time is up. All right, I'm, I'm moving up. Yeah, I'm moving on. Thank you, Titan. All right, so what I need to write next is that A is equal to, if you're not done, guys, it's okay. I'll give you a chance to, to, um, to finish up later on. Okay, A is equal to 180 was already on the other side of the equal sign. And remember, if I take my 65 or my positive 65 over my rainbow, it becomes minus 65 degrees. And if I take my positive 75 over the rainbow, it becomes minus 75 degrees. Okay. And then I'm going to write it here. Therefore, A is equal to. So now what we're doing is we're going to go onto our calculator and we're going to write 180 minus 65 minus 75, and then tell me what your calculator gives you. Okay, just pop it in the chat for me. 40 watt, Rande, not just 40, 40 watt. 
Thank you. I'm getting a lot of degrees. Thank you. Kimonelo, yes, very well done. And Kama as well. And Saneliso, well done, guys. Hello, Nami, for, with your 40 degrees. And Imi, thank you. 40 degrees. Good. And Dinako, if you don't have a calculator, I'm, I'm very embarrassed because we're in a maths class and we should all have a calculator. Uh, somebody says, Miss, I have a question. Ola, I need your hand up for me, please, my sweetie. Um, okay, everybody who's got their hand up, I'm going to assume that you have a question. Okay, so I'm going to start at the beginning. But before I take your questions, remember our therefore, I hope you guys are remembering, therefore, a is equal to 40 degrees. Okay. Alwande, I'm so sorry. You're going to have to check all your settings, your phone settings or your computer settings and all of that. Okay. And that's how we do this. This is the, the process that we need to follow. Okay. If you are still kind of weirded out by what just happened, I need you to please take a screenshot. Take a screenshot now. If you, if you can't take a screenshot, you're not sure how, Please write down everything that I've written on the screen. Okay. I'm gonna give everybody 30 seconds. Okay, and in the meantime, Ola, Hi, Miss. Hello, Ola. Uh, how are you, Miss? I'm good, thank you. How are you? Good. Um, you know, for this one that says A plus 65 plus 75 equals 180. Yes, sir. So if you uh did it in class and you put the brackets, does it meet does it um change anything or is it still the same? It doesn't at all. In fact, Lente has just put it in the chat for us. You say, if we put 65 plus 75 like that in brackets, is that what you're saying? Yes. That's fine. Because 65 plus 75 is going to give us 140. And 180 minus 140 is still going to give us 40 degrees. Okay. But that's just longer. It is. It is longer. But, uh, you know, whichever one you do, the maths is still going to be correct. So you're still going to get all your marks. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Miss. You can choose which one you want to do. Thanks for the question, Ola. No problem. Okay. So whichever one you guys are comfortable with, I'm seeing Lelente. Can we say 65 plus 75 degrees, then minus 140 from that? Yes, you can do that. You're more than welcome to do that. But that takes one extra step. Whereas in mine, I only have three steps and yours would have four steps. But it's, it's, it's perfectly fine. Okay. Kamanisi, I see you. Um, that's fine, my sweetie. You, you just, um, <laughs> Nokwezi says, I'm lazy, so the short way. I agree with you, Nokwezi. Come on, you see, just try and follow along as we go. All right. Um, okay. All right, we're going to try another one. Okay. Karma. If if we are if there's a number in front of the brackets, you're basically multiplying the sum. Yes, but the thing in front of the brackets today is a plus sign, and the plus sign doesn't really do anything. Or there's an invisible one actually over here. And one times sixty-five is just going to be sixty-five, and one times seventy-five is just going to be seventy-five. Okay, so it won't make a difference. Okay, all right, we're going to try another one. And remember, oh, okay, I didn't add it on here. Okay, we're going to try with a. Okay, I need you all to draw A, draw A quickly as we go along. Okay, quickly everybody draw A and then remember underneath your drawing, I need you guys to write statement and reason. Okay, and we're going to take it slowly from there. Okay. Yes, Buffet. Um, teacher Kat, can I just ask you, can you hear me? Because I'm having quite a lot of people with... with yes, you. I can hear you. And I'm okay, getting the same messages on my side. Okay, can I just get a thumbs up from everyone in the chat if you can hear me? Just to make sure um, something isn't wrong with the Zoom or something. Lena, I see that thumbs up in your camera. Thank you. 
I'm glad. Okay, guys, I'm glad that a lot of you guys can hear me because I'm I'm getting so worried. So many people are like, ma'am, I can't hear anything. Okay, that's great. Okay. And Bufay, it's can strange I because questions? they are connected to sound. So mm. I think it might be speaker settings on their side. Mm. Lina, I'm going to answer Bufay's question and then I'll answer yours. Okay. Bufay, do you have a question? Uh, <clears throat> uh, ma'am, uh, with the, the statement and reason thing, uh, yes. for, the, for the reason thing, do we always have to put like, an angle to the to describe this the the triangle or is or is it not needed which part can you show me which part uh, for the which? reason some is there's like a, a an angle then says some in triangle oh, do we yes. always have okay. to say so, that well yes and no um but i was trying to explain um before that um in maths, we're very lazy. So rather than write angles in maths, we use this little thing. This also means angles. Okay. So you can use the word angles, but because I'm lazy and I write really fast, and imagine if you have to do 50 of these, how many times are you going to like writing the word angles and triangle all over, over and over again? It's going to take you forever. Okay. So in yes. maths, we don't we don't mind just doing this little tiny little angle and an apostrophe s, um, and then at the end a triangle. In Nati, yes, they do allow this at school. So if you do this at school, you will get your marks. So that little angles it means angles. Okay, Bufe. Yes, ma'am. And I have a question. Yes. Doesn't sixty five plus seventy five equal hundred and forty? Then it does. Then how do you get to 180? Okay, so remember the inside angles of a triangle equal to 180, right? Yes. So what we're actually saying is that angle A plus 65 plus 75, all three of them together give us 180 degrees. Oh, okay. Okay. Thank you, That's why, see, do you see how I've written it here? I hope I didn't lose you. A plus 65 plus 75 degrees you see it i've added all three of them and all three of them gave me 180. okay thank you ma'am got it all right excellent all right lena can i take your question um ma'am do you write do we write, have do we have to write everything on the left side of the page or um, not particularly. Remember, you split your page in half, and then you're going to draw your picture. You're going to draw your triangle. Oh, you're going to draw the triangle, and underneath the triangle, you will have statement. And on the other side, where you folded your page in half, you'll have reason. Okay. So you. Uh, let me do a quick example on the side here. Uh, okay. So this next one. I'm, let's say, for instance, this is my page and I folded my page in half. There's my halfway mark on my page. I'm going to draw the triangle like this. And then that one has X over here. And I think it has 80 degrees over here and 60 degrees over here. Underneath this triangle that I've drawn, I'm going to write statement. And I'm going to underline it. And then on this side, I'm going to write reason. And I'm going to underline it. And then over here on statement, do you know what, what I'm going to write on this side? Um, no one. Okay, we're going to discuss it just now. Okay, hold on. We're going to discuss it together as a class. All right, thanks for that. Thanks for that. All right, um, Nokwezi is telling me, ma'am, I've already got the answer for A. I need you guys to, okay, can I ask everybody who can possibly take a screenshot? Please take a screenshot. Okay, just want to do something quickly before we continue because it'll just make my life so much easier. Okay, and then everybody pop pop the word done for me in the chat if you're done um, copying down a number one. And if you can, do A, B, and C. Okay, you don't have to do the statement and the reason. You can just put the, the, the drawings for me in the chat. I'm, I'm sorry, you can just do the drawings for now. Okay. 
Excellent. I'm getting quite a lot of dance. Okay, and then we're going to ask us on answer the first one together. Kama, are you asking a question? Can you give me a nod or a shake or do you want to answer a question? Do you have a question? Okay, can I ask you to unmute and ask your question? Ma'am, for the reason up top, can we say um, the all the interior angles of a triangle equal to 180 instead of saying the sum of a, the angle of a sum equals one and yeah, that, yeah. Okay, yes, yes, you can. You can, you can absolutely do that. Um, like I said, I'm very lazy. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go all the way around and do that. Yeah. But if you're okay with, with writing the angles of a triangle equal 180, you can do that. Okay, you're not wrong. You're absolutely right. Okay. Good stuff. All right. Can I ask you to answer this question for me before you go away? Let's answer A together. Okay, can you give me my statement? What am I gonna write underneath here on my statement side? Yes, Andy Nako, you need to write all of this down. What can I write on the side, Kama? Oh, it's really... Yes. <laughs> yes, um, yes, yes. A, I mean, X plus mm -hmm. 180 degrees. Oh, not 180. I mean, sorry, 80 degrees. 80 um, degrees, good. 60 degrees plus 60 plus degrees. degrees, good, is equal to? 180 degrees. Good, and what's my reason? All the interior angles of a triangle equal to 180. Good. good, you can write all interior angles of a triangle equal um, 180 degrees. I'm very lazy, so I'm just going to write angles sum in triangle and we're all going to get our marks. You're gonna get your marks, I'm gonna get my marks. Okay, excellent stuff, well done. All right, now next line, what do I write in the next line? Um, A equals oh, one. X equals. <laughs> oh, sorry, X equals Good. Um, 180. Good. Minus 80. Good, I'm gonna take my 80 over, minus 80 degrees. Minus mm -hmm. 60. Good, minus 60 degrees. And then my next line will read. Therefore. Good, therefore. A. I mean, X. X. Oh, I X. <laughs> Ooh, X is equals equal to, the answer, which is 40 what is degrees. The answer? 40 degrees. 40 degrees, excellent. How did that feel? Doesn't feel too weird, does it? No, it's, perfect. it's fine, right? It's not too bad. Okay, excellent. Well done. All right. <laughs> okay, let's uh, do the next one. Rangwato, are you ready to do the next one with me? Can you unmute for me, my sweetie? Rangwato, are you there? Oh, Rangwat is not answering. Oh my goodness. Okay, Nala, can I ask you to unmute for me, my sweetie? Um, hi, ma'am. Hello. All right, let's let's answer this one together. So I've got, ooh, how am I starting with my reason? Sorry, it's my statement and then my reason. Statement and then reason on the side. Give me my statement, please, Nala. Um, X plus 75 degrees plus mm -hmm. 80 degrees equals 180 degrees. Excellent, and what's my reason? Um, angles sum in triangle. Good, angles sum in triangle. All right, finish up for me on this side. Um, X equals 180 degrees minus 75 degrees minus 80 degrees. Good, okay, and my last line? Therefore, x equals Good. 25 degrees. Therefore, x is equal to 25 degrees. Very well done. I couldn't have put it better myself. Okay, very, very well done. Thanks, ma'am. All right, Ramatu, let's try that again. Can you unmute this time? Are you able to unmute? Yes, ma'am. Ah, excellent. Okay, let me just get my bearings right here. We're gonna do C quickly. 
Uh, let me proceed down. My drawings are coming out so small. There we go. Okay, and this one is a little bit of a tricky one, but I'm sure we're gonna get it. All right, so I have my statement and I have my reason. All right, give me my statement, my sweetie. Is it X a plus mm -hmm. 40 equals to 180 degrees? Oh, we skipped something right here. Okay, remember we need three. <sighs> we know okay. that there's X and there's 40. What is this angle over here? The one with the square? 90 degrees. Excellent. Yeah, 90 so we mustn't forget that one. Don't forget that one. Right, so it's yes. going to be X plus 40 plus? 90 degrees. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Finish up. No, the okay. reason is yes. The reason is angles sum and triangle. Very well done. Okay, angles sum and triangle. All right, finish my sum in the statement side. Uh, one hundred x equals to one hundred and eighty degrees minus forty degrees minus ninety degrees. Excellent. Mm -hmm. And the next line. Therefore, x equals to 50 degrees. Excellent. Very well done, Ramwadu. Always, always remember, they're going to be three angles. Okay. Don't forget them. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Very well done. Excellent stuff. All right. Okay. Can I get a number out of 10? Out of 10, how are we feeling about these questions? Okay. How are we feeling about these? 10 being, I understand, ma'am, I'm with you, I got this. One being, yo, ma'am, I don't know what's going on here. I'm getting a lot of tens. I'm even getting a lot of a thousands. Okay, that's okay. Titan, I hope you can see A, B, and C at the moment because we are on C. Okay. I'm seeing someone say four out of 10. No, Masubi, if you're still a bit stuck, we are going to do one or two more examples. So um, please take a screenshot of this so you can go and practice it. Tikelo is at a four and a half. Oh, sweetie. Oh. Somebody already can't wait for a brain break. Mm, excellent. Okay, I'm going to ask. I've seen Kanyusa saying hand up. Kanyusa, do you have a question? Ganyusa, can you unmute and ask your question? Ah, I see you just want to answer. Okay, we're going to get to a couple more of these. But before we get there, we're going to take a, a brain break and then we're going to come back to these. Okay. Um, all right. Teacher Cat, can I ask everybody who's got their hands down, um, uh, hands up? I need you guys to put your hands down because we're going to play, play the brain break. And then after that, you guys can raise them again. Okay. All right, teacher cat, are you ready? And you and I have done this one already, so you already know where I'm going with this one, yes? Yes. Okay, excellent. So I'm going on a cruise mm -hmm. and I'm going to bring voice. Teacher cat, what are you bringing? I'm going on a cruise and I'm bringing chakalaka. Oh, chakalaka. Teacher Cat, you're coming on the cruise today. Finally. Yo. Yay. <laughs> okay, I'm seeing somebody say chicken, beef, no. No, Mahubi says pap, she's definitely coming. Pap. Uh, somebody says sausage, burgers, no. Sanelisa says biltong, she's coming. Luna? Just try and guess. we're trying to guess what's happening here. So guess what you're gonna bring on the um, on the cruise. Okay, Caleb says he's going on a cruise and he's bringing drinks, but Caleb's not coming. Somebody says Amasi. Amasi, ah, Nota mm -hmm. says Amasi. Nota, you're definitely coming. Well done, Amasi. You're coming on the cruise. Well done. Somebody says KFC. No milk. No, you're not coming. Potato salad. No. 
Shana says Oros. Yes, Shana's coming. Oros. Well done, Shana. Somebody says Nuggets. No. Mesh. Mm -mm. No. Bila, so, no. Bila is bringing cow tongue. No. What? Cow tongue. Oh, no. Oh, somebody says, let me see. Let me see. I think I saw, I saw something. Is it a bride? No, Lisekho, it's not a bride. Jaden, zoom in. Olusha oh, says have a look. she has it. I wonder what Olusha thinks. Okay, somebody says see bride stand. Well, Ooh, Hichando's coming. He's bringing a bride stand. Oh, someone says Morocco. Oh, yay. Morocco is definitely Morocco is like a spinach, guys. So, yes. yes. You're definitely coming. Kota, yay. Somebody said Kota. They're definitely coming. Mm hmm Somebody said chicken feet. I can't give you chicken feet, so no. Mukhodu, yes. Uh, no, I actually can't. No, bring not Mukhodu. Tribe, no, we can't bring. Tribe, no, you're not coming. Mm. <laughs> says she have them all. Tando, somebody already said Kota. Ulusu. Hmm. Okay, no, I can't give you Ulusu either. Chicken Sushi, definitely not. Sorry, Thalia. Uh, Justin's bringing champagne. I mean... Justin, you're not coming on the cruise, but you can give me the champagne. Give us the champagne. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, Rolibua says, is it proper gusty food? No. I'll tell you why. Because I'm Come going on the cruise acha. and I'm bringing a vuvuzela. And Come a vuvuzela. Bring acha. Yes, acha. Whoever's bringing acha, you're coming. Let's go. So, Woo. no. Oh, Gushe says, I'm a guine. Guys, I'm so hungry now. I can't believe you guys. Right? You started this. Look now. <laughs> I'm a guine. Oh, somebody's, you're almost there, Imi. Um, somebody says they're bringing sundowns. Yes, you're going. Yeah. They're talking about Mamelodi sundowns. You're definitely going. We'll take the whole team. Somebody <laughs> says charcoal. No, I can't give you charcoal. Uh, somebody says, Nganisa says biryani. No, I can't give you biryani. Onami says slap chips. Yes, you're coming. Slap chips. You're coming. No, not green salad. Gareth, no, I can't give you. Uh, Yo, there's so many messages. Nondumisa says Royal AM. Yes, if you bring the whole team, the whole Royal AM team, you're coming. Cool. Somebody says Chiefs. If you're bringing Chiefs and Pirates, you're going. Someone yes. bring the spring box. Yes, if you're bringing the spring box, you're definitely coming. Now that should give it away, guys. Spring box. Yeah. Really? Somebody says Liverpool and Manchester United. No, we're not coming. Kim Kardashian is not allowed on this cruise. Nala, you cannot bring beer. You are way too young. Kamuhelo <laughs> <laughs> yeah. says the Proteas. Yes, you're coming. Mm. Lesero says South African famous food. No. I would agree with you, but unfortunately, Sundowns is not a food. There is. Nati says, <laughs> is it South African related? Mm. Oh, yes, it is. Justin, you can't bring Drake. Somehow South African related. Somebody says they're bringing Bafana Bafana. They're definitely coming. Someone bringing chicken dust. <laughs> chicken dust, yes. <laughs> you're coming. If you're bringing, if you're bringing Jacob <laughs> Zuma, you're coming. I don't know how I feel about Jacob Zuma coming, but yes, if yeah. you're bringing Jacob Zuma, you're definitely coming. There's a lot going on. Sushi, here. no. Jazzy Q, yes. Ooh, oh Elon my Musk. goodness. Yes, you can bring Elon Musk. He's coming. Cool. Elon Musk can come. He must bring his money with him. <laughs> uh, somebody says they're bringing the, the EFF. Yes, they, you can definitely come. Dr. Kumalo can come. Uh, Donald Trump cannot come. Oh, yay, Sipa Sikha finally saw it. I think Sipa Sikha, you're onto something. Kelly Kumalo, you can come. If you bring Kelly Kumalo. Lelen just said it's South African related stuff, ma'am. Yes, absolutely, guys. Because, and somebody in the other class actually said it, because next week is actually Heritage Month. We are doing yes. everything South African related. Exactly. Like Uncle Waffles and Ricky Rick and the South African cricket team and the South African soccer team. Now, if you guys notice all of these things like BAP, and Biltong and Acha, you can only really find these things in South Africa. And that was the point of the game today. So when we say we're going on a cruise and we're, and we're bringing something specific, we're trying to see what they all have in common. Okay. 
I think Luna was a little bit lost there because it was, was a first long day. chat. That wow. was a long one. Ooh, you guys really filled up the chat, hey? Well, well done, guys. Sure. Okay. All right. Let's do a quick stretch. Everybody stretch. Let's stretch. We're going to continue with all of this. Okay. You guys are with me here. All right. Stretch this way. Okay. We are going to continue. I think we are on D. We're on question D. And I hope you guys are ready. Not how your hand is already up. I'm going to ask you first to answer D for me. Why am I going that way? No. Okay, we are over here. All right. All right, Nata, are you ready? Are you going to be able to answer D with me? Can you unmute for me, my darling? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma All right, okay. Hold on, I just need to put it down quickly. Give me one second. See, here we go, there's D. Paste it down. All right, there we go. I'm very sorry about the um the quality of my pictures they're not so great statement yes, and reason all right let's go for it give me my uh -huh. statement darling. uh x plus 51 plus 0 0.5 plus 47 equals 180 excellent 51 degrees plus 47 degrees is equal to 180 degrees give me my reason uh angle sum in triangle Good, angle sum in triangle. Okay, give me my next line. Uh, I said X mm -hmm. equals 180 minus 51 minus 47. Good, and my last line? Therefore, Good. One hundred. Yeah. therefore 180, Minus Ooh, not 180. X is equal to therefore. Oh, X is equal to. Mm -hmm. Now you have to use your calculator. Remember, I told you you're going to need a calculator. <laughs> now you're, you're actually going to have to punch this into your calculator. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Uh, 51. Minus 47 equals 4. Oh, I think you skipped the 180 part. So you're supposed to go 180 minus 51 minus 47. Minus 176. Oh, OK. You're going to have to check in the chat, OK? Because I think your, your calculator math is a little bit off, but um, Bulela and Letu, oh, not Letu, and Nontando, let you check your calculating minus again, and Talia also calculates. Minus 47. 82. 82 what? 82? 82 degrees. Good. Don't forget that degrees. Otherwise, it could be donkeys or apples or whatever. So it needs to be 82 degrees. Degrees. Okay. We need to remember the order that we do things in. Okay. How are you feeling yeah. about this question? Uh, fine, ma'am. Okay, let's try the next one. Okay, I'm going to try with Nala, but um, we can continue going. All right. Yes, ma'am. All right, excellent stuff. Love the energy, love you for trying. Nala, are you ready? We're going to do the next one together. Okay, we're going to do E together. Just need to clip it because sure, it's going to take me forever to get there. All right, there we go. Nala, are you ready? No, oh, Nala's not unmuting. What's going on? Statement. Oh, Anati, would you like to take this one? Because I'm not I'm not having Nala unmute for me. Oh, there we go. There's Nala. Hello, Nala. Hi, ma'am. Sorry about that. No issues. All right, give me my statement for this one. For now, for e. Um, x plus 25 degrees plus 18 degrees equals 180 degrees. Excellent. Is equal to 180 degrees. And give me my reason. Um, angle sum in triangle. 
Excellent. Angle sum in triangle. Finish up for me. X equals 180 degrees minus 18 degrees minus 25 okay. degrees. Excellent. I'm going to follow exactly what you're saying. And then my last line. Therefore, X equals 137 degrees. Well done. All right. Amazing stuff. Very well done. Okay. He, I, I couldn't have put a bit of myself. Very well done, Nala. Okay. Um, Anati, I'm so sorry. Can I ask Onami to do the last one for me? I just haven't heard his voice today. Okay. Onami, are you there? Yes, ma'am. Excellent. Okay, just give me one second while I copy paste it. Just to make sure we don't. Okay. Uh, there it is. All right, we're going to do the last one together, you and I. Okay. Give me my statement, please, my sir. Is it um, X plus 109 plus 32 equals to 180 degrees? Good. And my reason? Um, angle sum in triangle. Sum in triangle. Good. Can you finish the statement side for me, please, my sweetie? X is equal to 180 degrees minus mm -hmm. 109 degrees minus 32 degrees. Excellent. All right. And then? Therefore, X is equal to 39 degrees. 39 degrees. Ah, oh, excellent. You did that so beautifully. Thank you, Nontando, for, for popping that answer in the chat just in time. Very well done, Onami. Very, very well done. Thank you, ma'am. All right. Okay. Oh, no, no, Mahibi, I'm so sorry. I don't know what's going on. Uh, Inati, I'm so glad you're like, I wish the lessons were every day. Me too, kind of. I love maths. All right. But that's where we that's where we end today. See, Elisa, you're saying although, ma'am, I'm guessing something else is coming after that, although. Um, I just need to get an emoji from you guys in the chat. Tell me how you're feeling about statement and reasons for angles, sum, and triangle. We are done, Oluche. This, this is all that we're going to do for today. Okay, that's all that we've got. I'm loving the thumbs up. Gaho gives me a smile. Neo's feeling good. Caleb says it's easy. I know. Okay, it's quite easy once you get the hang of it, hey? It's very easy when you get the hang of it. Well done, guys. I'm so proud of you. Kanye's like so, so. Kanye, trust me, if you watch the video again, you're going to feel a lot more comfortable okay Ramadu, i'm glad it makes you love maths okay um patu thank you for reminding them that it's only one emoji Lisejo, you can ask me a maths question yes ma'am hello Lisejo. hi ma'am ma'am yeah. i had trouble hearing you when you were still explaining how did you get to 180? Because when I calculate them, the two mm -hmm. angles, it doesn't give me 180. Okay, which which one are you talking about? All of them, ma'am. A, B, C, okay, D. Okay, so remember, remember, Lesejo, the inside angles, all three of them added together need to give me 180. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So X plus 80 degrees, plus 60 degrees. When I add them all up together, they need to give me 180 degrees. Okay, so I know that if 80 plus 60 is already 140, X needs to be 40 degrees because together they must equal 180 degrees. Okay, that is the yes. rule in maths. The rule in maths says the inside angles of a triangle must all equal to 180 degrees. Thank you, ma'am. Sure, you're very welcome. Okay, I see another Lesejo. I think you also may have a question. Thank you, Teacher Cat. I was just about to ask you to put the link to the quiz in the chat. Lesejo, do you have a question? No, ma'am. I just want to tell you a small joke. Oh, absolutely. This is the perfect time for a joke. Go for it. Okay, ma'am. So I have 10 eggs. I mm -hmm. take three. I mm -hmm. fry three. And I eat three. How many eggs do I have left? 
seven eggs? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> oh, okay. I thought maybe I was wrong. I thought maybe there was like a, a catch somewhere. Okay, no. Because uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. right. I was like, yeah, but I fried them all and I ate them all. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's correct. There we go. Okay. All right, guys. Um, that's it from us today.